Yoga is an elaborate set of techniques developed over centuries to promote the integration of the mind, body, and spirit. This video will describe two simple yoga movements that you can utilize in the workplace. Typically, yoga practice is done after our bodies are warmed up and our stomachs are empty. If you are doing these movements outside of a full yoga practice, you must do them gently. The point is not to prove your flexibility, but to listen to your body's intelligence. First, I will teach you a simple side bend. This can easily be done while taking a break or waiting for another task. While doing the side bend, remember that your breathing should remain free-flowing. If you suppress your breath, yoga will lose its benefit for you. Breath suppression is actually a signal that your body sends to your mind when a crisis is occurring. Stand with your feet slightly apart. Raise the right arm up into the air comfortably. Do not overreach. Make sure your arm stays solidly in the shoulder socket. While exhaling, bend to the left side gently. Remember that if you are doing this for inner peace, you are not going to push your flexibility to the farthest extent possible. Bring your awareness to the sensation in your left and your right side. And when you feel done, inhale and straighten up. Bring your right arm down. Now do the other side. Raise the left arm up. Relax the arm back down into its socket and while exhaling, bend to the right side gently. Bring a smile to your face. Continue to breathe comfortably. Bring your awareness to the sensations in your left and right side. And when you feel done, inhale and straighten up. Bring your left arm down Notice how you feel. Make an agreement with yourself to do a side bend when you next feel like you can use it. Next, I will lead you through a seated twist movement. You can view the twist as rinsing out stress so that you have a fresh body afterwards. I have adapted this movement from a course in trauma-sensitive yoga. From the preventive medicine point of view, this pose should be avoided by people with sacroiliac problems. From a seated position, first let your mind settle on your intention to relax. Then, as you inhale, sweep both arms high up above your head, and as you exhale, gently turn to the right, bringing the left hand across the right thigh and the right hand to the right hip. On your next inhale, sweep both arms up, and on your exhale, gently turn to the left, bringing the right hand across the left thigh and the left hand to the left hip. Good. Now let us go to the other side and hold the posture longer. Inhale, sweep the arms up high above your head and as you exhale, gently turn to the right. Bring the left hand across the right thigh and the right hand to the right hip. Keep the spine long. Breathe with as much of the lungs as you can. Your breath becomes the primary movement. Feel your body responding to the deep breath. Encourage your chest to lift otherwise your abdominal organs are unnecessarily compressed. While you hold this pose, you might like to yawn, sigh, breathe out through your mouth, do whatever feels comfortable. Then inhale, 
both arms up to the center and exhale to the left side. Bringing the right hand across the left thigh and the left hand to the left hip. Never forcing it physically, make sure you can breathe freely and deeply. Remember the nice rinsing sensation around the spine. Hold this posture for 20 seconds. Finally, inhale both arms up to the center, breathe deep, and exhale back to your natural sitting position. When you do this in your workplace, take a minute if you can before standing up and resuming your day. Yoga can be one of the many strategies you use to neutralize the stress, crisis, and trauma around you. If you think yoga can play an important role in managing trauma, then I recommend finding a qualified teacher. While this is not a medical treatment, it can be part of effective self-care. Regular practice will make relaxation a habit, and you can return to it when you need mental clarity, creativity, and strength. Consistent use of these techniques can condition your mind and body to relax on demand, even when you are stressed.